Hi everyone, this video will explain how to set up floor time and its benefits for your piggies. What you will need is one Heidi house per guinea pig. You will also need some chew toys so they stay occupied during their playtime. And a plastic mat to protect the flooring, a fleece to keep them comfortable and some friction for them to run on. You can use a hay rack or a container to put the hay in so it doesn't get messy, but that's optional. And obviously some hay. As well as a water source. I'm using a water bottle today because that's what's best for my guinea pig. Also put some snacks in there so your guinea pig has something to munch on. Floor time provides a great form of exercise for your guinea pigs. Whenever your guinea pig lives in a smaller cage, it's important for your piggies to have playtime slash floor time at least an hour a day. Floor time is important because it provides good physical and mental stimulation for your guinea pigs. If you don't provide floor time for your piggy, it will have a risk of heart issues, heart disease, respiratory problems, bladder problems, bumble feet, arthritis, and even diabetes. The more exercise your guinea pigs can get, the less likely they are to develop those illnesses. Floor time will make your guinea pig more happy because guinea pigs love to explore their surroundings. So make sure before the play area is all set up, it is 100% piggy proof, which means it's a safe place to where your guinea pig cannot get a hold of anything to chew on or no possibility of escaping or injuring themselves. Floor time can be held in a pen or in a room. Ensure that the area is secured and your guinea pigs cannot get trapped under, in, or behind any objects. Make sure that there's no wires or other potential dangerous objects around. You should also protect your floor in case the guinea pig has to use the restroom. I have a plastic layer underneath the fleece so your guinea pig is comfortable by the fleece. You're protecting your carpet so you both have a win-win. Also, any new guinea pig owners, please make sure that your guinea pigs are never walked on harnesses or on put into exercise balls or wheels, even if it says so on the packaging that it's made for guinea pigs. They are really not. Guinea pigs' bodies weren't designed for this type of movement or exercise as they may call it. It also may cause serious injuries to your piggy. Remember, guinea pigs are not as flexible as hamsters or ferrets are. It's okay if your piggy is too shy to come out of their hidey house, especially if they are not tamed yet or if they are not used to floor time. It is important to give them enrichment like hiding treats around before you put your piggy in so they will have fun investigating. Now set a timer for one hour so your guinea pig has plenty of playtime. While Stuber is having playtime, I go ahead and clean his cage. Right now, he's in this temporary cage because we are currently moving. So, yeah.
Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date with my latest videos. I hope you enjoyed today's video and found it helpful. So if you did, click like or feel free to leave a comment sharing your experiences and ideas for floor time. I'll see you all next time on Emily's Farm Life. Bye!